know about the real chance of an even greater February freeze tonight with more extreme cold on the way. And Natalie mm -hmm. is here to explain that because we're kind of in this calm before the next storm. That's right. We had just a taste of it this morning. Yeah. And there's another potential for another round of freezing weather that could impact Austin more tomorrow morning. So right. we're already on the lookout for that. Uh, this morning, we did see some light snow, light freezing precipitation out over our southeastern corner. So from San Marcos over to Bastrop and south to LaGrange, they saw some uh, light ice on the roads, even some snow accumulating down near the San Marcos area with a little ice mixed in. Even this morning, this late morning, we saw a little snow flurries reported near the Burnett area. But as you notice right now on a satellite radar, just the cloud cover, the gray skies out there. Take a look for you a downtown, gray conditions almost everywhere. With that, really cold temperatures. Now, you're looking at right now are the wind chills. This is the actual temperature factored in with the amount of uh, wind we have out there, what it feels like. Earlier this morning, we had wind chills in the single digits out in the hill country. Right now, they're up to around 10 degrees in Burnett. Same with Georgetown, so it feels extremely cold outside. If you have to be out for long periods of time today, make sure you're appropriately dressed. Your heaviest coat, your mittens, your scarf, hat, all of it uh, because it feels so chilly. It feels like 24 right here in Austin. The actual temperatures below freezing across the board in the 20s still out in the hill country. It's currently 23 degrees in Burnett, Georgetown 23, San Marcos 28, 30 degrees right now in Bastrop and 29 degrees right here in Austin. We aren't really going to warm up all that far this afternoon either. We'll only make it to right above the freezing mark. 35 will be your afternoon high later on today. Cloudy skies all the way through. We could see maybe a little more flurry activity. Uh, very patchy. That chance is only about 10%. Most of us will stay dry for the rest of the day today. Just a cold one out there. By 8 p.m. with overcast skies, we're down to around 31. Now, like we mentioned, we have another round of 20s overnight tonight expected with that chance for some freezing drizzle. We'll go hour by hour through your forecast a little later in first morning weather.